Hello, and welcome back once again to Jeff Finnegan's Wake, the project where I, Jeff, read the book Finnegan's Wake to you one page at a time, one day at a time. Finnegan's Wake, of course, being the novel published by James Joyce in 1939. We are on to page number 243, and uh, this is especially tongue twistery, so I'm just going to get right to it, because it's not that much fun to read. So, 243, here we go. Coming to the pictures more as hundreds Elsker Elks, Yehards of Annam's Call Anyway, Factory Fresh, and Fuming at the Mouth, Wronged by Chwemwegnot Noget, Magrath Magrith, he to cable a rat for that early party, and Wentzforth, Ani Mama and her Fierty Bustles, Terrified of Gmir Gnomes of Mountains and Furibound to be back in her My Tin Betty, Shy, shy, she fainted all souls at Pig and Puggin, and gets a pan in her stummy from the Pialabalars in their pure war. Yet, Jack tick tating all of around her for about his poorliness due to panelism and grime, for that he harbored her when fem soul, her Zoravarn Liord and Givner General, and led her in ancient, ancient, consort room and bound her Durant coverture so as she could not steal from him, oz her or damn him, so as if ever she's believed by cheek and bruth, death since both was parties to the feed, it's Hetman McCume Hall foots the funeral. Meanwhile she nurture him Jason from her Elmer's alms dish, Giantar and Shana as same as Br- Brondus with Foley Signer's Tinner Rome Romanchi to fishel the lead wigs out of her lug wags, like a skittering kitty scattering hails, when his favorites were all beruffled on him and her own undesirables gesticulating. It was such a blowick day. Wind and wand and wild like a wench and wend and wanton. The why if he but would bite and plug his backy pipes and renounce the devlins in all their pums and kept the streel workers out of the plague, and netlaces milk from sickling the honeycomb, and cop ulo bubo selling four foul, faulty t- tree peas. She would make massa dinars with her souvenir dealnish and delicate her nut brown glory clouk to Mady Bernice and hang himself herself in Ostman's town St. Megan's and make no more. Mullier edge before Mahatmas or Moslemans, but would undulate her sugar loft hat from Alpaliri with a viv bazalgia and a clasmat apatria like any purple cardinal's princess or woman of the grave word to the papal legate from the Vaticum Monsignor Rabinsolm Crucis with an ass of milk to his cowmate and chitterlings on account of of all he quaqueduxed for the honor of Ram and the nations aboard him, and what mezzo scudo to St. Percy O'Reilly that gave Luis Mario's Josephs their loyal devouches to be offered up misses for vouts for witters. Oh my god. That was page 243. This book is confounding. It's not fun to read. I don't, I'm not really getting any enjoyment out of it. I'm reading Infinite, uh, I'm sorry, uh, Infinite Jest the same way. And I'm, I, I, that, that's fun to read. Finnegan's Wake is not, Finnegan's Wake is a chore. I don't look forward to it. <laughs> but I'm going to keep doing it because I want to fucking see this to completion. So that was page number 243 here on Finnegan's Wake. Good night. <laughs>